I've got a question for you. How do you do your invoicing? Now, me personally, I have tried everything. Back in the day, I can remember I hand wrote invoices using an invoice pad at one point, and then I moved to the computer and I would create invoices in Microsoft Excel or Microsoft Word. I've tried different invoicing services. I even tried Evernote for a short and unhappy period of time. Uh, but they've all of those systems have left me either looking unprofessional or not in control of my receivables or just plain confused. Then I discovered Wave. Oh my goodness. Stick around. Steve Dotto here. How the heck are you doing this fine day? At Dotto Tech, we make technology easy so you can do more. And if there is one technology that I believe needs to be easy, er, it's accounting. I, whatever side of the brain is your side that's wired for accounting in those processes, Mine seems to be a bit faulty. It's just never been my strength. It's always filled me with all sorts of insecurities and frustration. And one of the things I'm best at in the world of accounting is basically procrastinating, putting things off. I needed to find an accounting package that worked for me and made sense. And none of the accounting software out there really did, as far as I was concerned anyways. I, I always got confused with each and every one, and I will take more responsibility for this than placing blame on the accounting software. However, having said all of that, I st started to use a tool called Wave, Wave Apps. It's a Canadian company, and although their accounting systems work for internationally for everybody, as far as I can tell at least, but everything changed for me when I started to use Wave. And let me tell you how I got started in Wave because I bet it's something that might, you might find advantage in. I was looking for, to, to, to just produce some invoices. I was still using an accountant, and I still do use an accountant, but I was using an accountant for doing all of my books, but I just needed better control of my invoicing. My accountant told me that I needed to do a better job of my invoicing. Actually, they insisted on it rather sternly. So I was looking for accounting software. Being cheap, I was looking for free accounting software that could create invoices. And that's all I want to do is create invoices. And there's lots of different tools out there and lots of different methods, some of which we mentioned at the top. You can create your own in Microsoft Word. Uh, there are invoicing services, some software services, uh, online services that you can use to create invoices. And they all work pretty well and they track your invoices for you and they manage all of your taxes, et cetera, and create reports. But then I found Wave and Wave advertised that their account, that their invoicing services were free. And I thought that sounds fantastic. Full invoicing free. And I can do, put out invoices with my logo and that look professional and I can track them. Um, I'm going to give it a shot. And I did. And I'm glad I did because I'm going to show it to you right now. You can go to wave apps and sign up for free. Uh, to, to use their services. And uh, when you sign up, they're going to ask you a few basic questions about the type of business you're in, just so they can structure things. Now, one thing about Wave is they really have a lot of handholding. They've got online help. As soon as you sign up and you go in, there's going to be a little chat bot that's going to appear in the bottom corner and they're going to welcome you and you're going to feel nice and warm and fuzzy from them. And they offer you this, look at what they do. They said, check out our webinar page. The webinar page that they offer gives you some free tutorials and training. Now, if you're thinking about doing more than just invoicing, I would would definitely take advantage of this because they can go through all of the different services and teach you how to do them properly as you're setting things up. This is well worthwhile getting started on the right foot. But if you just want to start with the lowest impact and you just want free invoicing, stick around. I'll show you what you need to do here right now. If we take a look at our dashboard here within Wave, we can see all of the different services they've got. I believe it's free until you start using their payroll services. So all of your basic balancing of your books, your invoicing, your purchases, all of that uh, is available for free. Uh, we are going to take a look at getting paid for work, basically sending unlimited invoices and estimates. And I'm going to take you into the module and show you just the basic setup. So you can choose a, diff a template. You can add your logo, you can pick color. This is just about branding and making your invoices look professional. What's really important is the mechanisms in the background, but you can make your invoices look as good as you choose, include corporate, your logo, etc. So once you've basically set up those parameters, let's take a look. 
all of the main fields. You just go through these fields, fill them in, and the invoice is pretty much ready to go. So you can add customers. You put in the customer information. Now, it will save all of your customer information in here. So you put in the customer name. You put in their email address, phone number, contact name, should you need it. And this will act as a little bit of a database to, for when you return next time and you build that customer again. And you've also then got a customer record uh, that you're going to need for other accounting and CRM type purposes. Uh, it will automatically number your invoices. You can put in purchase order numbers. It'll create the date and the payment due. That's all pretty much as you would expect. Here's where you really begin customizing things, where you start adding items. And at this point here, if you've taken the tutorial, you'll understand how you've got different revenue accounts, etc. But if you don't, you can just start to enter an item. And I'm going to say that this is going to be a mini course. I'm selling a mini course, let's say, to somebody. So I create an item and I item description, a uh, YouTube course. We're going to say we're selling them a YouTube course. This is for our purposes and for their purposes. YouTube cor course, course. There we go. So of course, of uh, course is a course, of course, of course. There we go. YouTube's. <laughs> ah! Ah! Done. Make it capital. Good Lord, Dotto. You're like, this is bad. You should have seen it when I had to make my own from scratch. Oh, good Lord. Okay. Quantity and price. Okay. We're going to say $99. All right. Now it's where it gets interesting. One of the things you want your invoicing tool to do is to track your taxes. So here you can set up all of your different taxes. In Canada, we have something called the GST, the goods and services tax, which is at 5%, I think. So you set that up and this is a recoverable tax, meaning that I can deduct tax that you've paid from this tax that you've collected. So this is the beginning of the entire accounting process. So when I'm buying things, it's going to track my GST. When I'm selling, it's going to track my GST so that I can just submit to the government the difference between what I'm purchasing and what I'm selling. It works pretty well. Whether it's not, it's a compound tax. And we're ready to go. So you can have multiple taxes. For instance, in some Canadian provinces, we have provincial sales tax. You can layer that on for certain things. But you can see it's calculated it right here. Oh, wait a minute. What about the currency? What currency are we in? Look down here at the bottom. I'm in Canadian dollars, but you can choose any currency. So if I want to bill in US dollars, it bills in US dollars. And this is something that I appreciate hugely in Canada is it does the conversion based on the date of the invoice or the receivable. So it, it then, so I can accurately translate into Canadian dollars my US dollar billing, which quite often I bill my product out in. For anybody that does cross-border work, this is a golden tool added, again, for free. Once you've created all of these different elements, you can then save the invoice and you can continue. I better put a customer in. G just give me a second, I'll put a fake customer in. Okay, I've created me as a customer because I want you to see the invoice, how it's sent. All right, so I've created this invoice for a mini course. It's my very first ever uh, invoice. It's in US dollars. We will make it in US dollars. There we go. And I save and continue. Now, it's set to go. And it creates a kind of an audit trail or a draft process where you've created it as a draft. If you say have somebody that's doing invoicing and somebody else has to approve on your team, you can now go in and I can go in and I can check this and I can approve it. You can see what it's going to look like right down here. This is what the invoice looks like. Now I didn't do any adding of logos, etc. but you can see it's a professional looking invoice, which is great. I'm going to approve it. You are approved and watch this. I love this. You can send the invoice directly out of Wave Accounting. Not only can you send the invoice, they will send it using their mail server or you can use your own email to send the invoice. So I can send this from my own personal or my own business Gmail address should I choose to send it. But let's instead send it from Wave. You can send a copy to yourself as well. So I'll send a, a copy to myself and you can attach the invoice as a PDF or have it embedded in the email. I'm going to set, attach as a, a PDF because most people like to have that. They like to be able to have a downloadable that they can then save or print off for their accounting. It's been sent. So 
other, some other features that are built in here is you've got the ability to send reminders or, or remind yourself of the invoice as it, it becomes due or past due. And of course, then it's all going to be tracked here. Let's just go over in your dashboard. If we go to our dashboard, we should see we have one invoice. There's, there we go. This gives you a graphical snapshot and a summary of everything that's happening in your business. There, I've got one invoice coming due, and of course, I don't have any other data in here. Now, Wave is a full online, full-featured accounting package, so I could sync all of the accounts with my bank account. Uh, it can be synced with, uh, with my bank account, with my credit card, uh, with other financial services, and you could also set up a variety of different payment options in it, which I'm not gonna get into right now because this demo will just get too long, uh, but it's got all of those services that are included. And once you sign up, they will of course be letting you know about the services uh, that they offer. Once this is all said and done, let's go take a look at the invoice. And here it is, Dottotech sent you an invoice. I can view it online or I can download the PDF. Here's the PDF. Let's open the PDF so you can view it here just in the window. It's exactly as we expected it to look. There we go. I could also view it online in the browser. So those are the two options you have for delivery of the invoices. And there it is in the browser. And if you've enabled any payment options, you will be able to, at this point here, be able to just click here and receive a payment of a credit card payment or other online payment right from within this window. We've just scratched the surface of what Wave apps will do. As I say, it's a full featured accounting package. What I love about this is you can start with something like just doing your invoicing, which we all need to do very early on in our business career. Uh, and then you can grow with this app as you need more and more services. You can set it up for receivables, you can set it up for payables, you can set it up for doing all of your bank balances and doing the, all of your basic accounting. And eventually, as you grow, you can set it up and you can do payroll services, you can collect money. All of that is built in to Wave Accounting. It's a tool that you can start small for free with, look professional, be more organized, and then it will grow. And once you your business reaches a point that it needs far more sophisticated capabilities, Wave is still a tool that's gonna to work terrifically for you. I'm a big fan. Well, I hope you found this video today to be useful. I look forward to your comments and suggestions in the YouTube comments below. I promise you one thing, I read each and every comment, even if I don't have time to reply to them all. And if you'd be so kind, I'd love it if you'd share this video, especially with friends of yours who may need to set up invoicing for themselves. And while you're at it, click subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when we upload new videos here at Dotto Tech. Till next time, I'm Steve Dotto. Have fun storming a castle. <laughs>